welcome back to another video y'all if you never seen my face before my name is olivia and if you're not new here hey boo thank the both of y'all for clicking on the video but today is monday what's today's date november 27th maybe something like that yeah today is monday november let me see yeah today is monday november the 27th and we just starting off a new vlog i'm currently at work right now i'm on my lunch break and i just wanted to go ahead and start this vlog introduce it and everything like that have no idea what we're doing but um just want to go ahead and get the introduction out the way so yeah we're just about to start on the vlog we got vibes and i'll pick up the camera when we're doing something interesting later on today or at the work or whatever okay so i'm back home work was not terrible as i thought it was gonna be because Usually when you come out from like a long weekend or a break, you think it's gonna be like bad, but it wasn't that bad. And right now what I'm about to do, because I did not wake up this morning and did do my 30 minutes on the treadmill like I was supposed to. So I'm gonna do like, we're gonna kind of have like a little productive night. So I need to do that and then I'm gonna cook. That be the craziest thing though. You be at work all day, you don't be feeling like doing nothing when you come home. That's why I hate getting up in a, I hate getting up in the morning, but I hate like having to do a workout or something even more at the work because I do get home, you just want to chill. Like, if you know, you know that nine to five life, like you should be wanting to chill, but I'm starving. So I'm finna make this protein shake first before I get on the treadmill. Something not too much, just light. I'm not gonna show y'all this protein powder because it's really terrible. This is just something I got in the meantime that I can run through until I get like my regular kind, but I'm pretty sure we all done ate terrible this weekend. I'm not the only one. Don't try to act like you just ate all good and everything. So that's why I'm cooking. And I'm just trying to work on being more disciplined in all aspects of life. So, which I've been pretty good with my eating. But this weekend, like, I haven't had a, okay, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I haven't cooked once in, like, four days. Probably last time I cooked was, like, last Wednesday or something. Because other holidays. So I've been eating not terrible, but I have, like, I just enjoyed my holiday between Thanksgiving food and stuff like that. So, so I'm gonna cook tonight and then I meal prepped for like three days. I had that for lunch earlier today and I did like a huge grocery restock yesterday, but I'm starving. So I need something before I get on a treadmill, but yeah. She see money all around me. I look like I'm the man. Okay, workout is complete. I know y'all can tell it on my face. I'm just gonna heat this oven up to 425. I'm gonna let my Brussels sprouts dry out so they can, well, like, y'all know what I mean. So I can cook them. And I'm gonna start on this chicken. I just marinated chicken real basic. Adobo seasoning, pepper, garlic powder, onion powder. And get some of this in your kitchen. So you can either get this or the Dale seasoning. That smells so good, y'all. But we usually do low sodium, but this goes on steak, chicken, pork chops, salmon, any other type of fish, shrimp. Like you can put this on anything, it tastes so good. But I'm gonna just cook. And then I'm gonna finish up my protein shape. But yeah, I definitely gotta get up in the morning because I do not like working out at nighttime because it's already 6.30. Now, if I usually worked out at nighttime, that would be okay because I would go to bed at like 11, but now I go to bed at nine, so I get up at five. Well, like in between nine and 10. <sighs> but y'all don't, do not underestimate walking. Because if you got an incline, see that particular um, treadmill that we got, it's stuck, like they bought it like that. like. Cause my mom had one on one like way, way, way back in the day. And it's like stuck on the incline. So you can't let it up or let it down. But the incline is actually like kind of steep. So 30 minutes on that at like the fat burning level definitely gets the job done because I'm feeling it. And like my legs was trying to act like we ain't did no workout. And like, well, it's been a couple of days, but my legs are like starting to burn and stuff. And I don't know, but yeah, I'm gonna do that. Well, I'm gonna, actually, I'm gonna hop in the shower real quick and then we're gonna come back and cook because I just feel disgusting. So we're gonna hop in the shower real quick. Well, not real quick, we're gonna bathe, but we're gonna hop in the shower. 
And then that walk done did something to me. Y'all gotta use the bathroom. I know y'all don't really care to hear that, but that may be a little, a little too much, a little TMI, but like it ran right through me or whatever I ate today that ran through me. So I will come back when I done start cooking and I'll show y'all like, I like simple meals. I'm not doing much. I'll talk to y'all after I get out the shower. This is dinner. Just got some teriyaki chicken, these Brussels sprouts, some avocado, and then having this caramel water. This is the probiotic water. But I said I was gonna be like super productive, which I think I was. But now I'm tired. Like while my food was cooking, I was unloading the dishwasher and stuff. There's clothes in there that I need to fold, but I don't think it's gonna get folded tonight because I don't work that. I'm just tired. So I'm just have this. Mmm, it's so good. That hot. Got to decide to cook them on the stove top instead of in the oven because it's already like 7.30. And I figured that wasn't gonna, was gonna take too long. But I think I really like these Brussels sprouts on the stove top too. Like, enjoy the rest of my night. I highly doubt I come back on camera. Like, I'ma eat this and I'ma finish off the rest of that protein shake. And then we're gonna be in there and ready to go to bed, honey, okay? So it's the next night, it is Tuesday. I did not vlog today, early day, cause there really wasn't nothing going on today that was like super vlog worthy. But um, since it is nighttime, I wanna talk about some of the new habits that I've been trying to implement. So the first one, I talked about this in one of my other vlogs. I have been using this, cause this, I got this devotional and I got that, um, that financial, that budget plan. I really been using that like, a lot um if i can find it i'll link it down below um because it's from amazon but i've been using that a lot i kind of i keep i'm looking over there at my purse because i keep it in my purse because like every time like my budget and stuff like i write stuff down but with me creating new habits and trying to be more disciplined you know we got to spend time with the lord and everything like that so i'm really trying to be better about i always pray don't get me wrong i do that but i'm trying to be better about getting into the word and kind of just changing my life a little bit like trying to you know tidy up the loose ends because sometimes i'll be out here living any kind of way and that's not that's not good so um trying to so this is the my quiet time devotional 365 devotions of peace in the presence of god so this has been helping me because with the Bible, I can read the Bible, but it should be a little more interesting. Let me just go ahead and point it out. So I'm start off with this, and I was watching this video, which is crazy. I was watching this video because I don't like I grew up in church and everything, so I'm not like you know, the Bible and stuff like that. It's not foreign to me. Like I know you know Bible stories and all that kind of stuff. But I was watching this video, this girl, and like how to read the Bible. So. Once I finish watching it, if I think it's good advice, I'll link it down below for y'all because I got to finish watching it. I fell asleep on it last night. But with implementing new habits, trying to start the day with God, end the day with God. So like the last 30 minutes of the day, praying and reading, spending time with God. And, but yeah, just trying to implement new habits, especially going into the new year, disconnecting from my phone. Because like after I stop recording this, I'm going to put my phone over there. I'm going to... Uh, set my alarm and everything and this is gonna be the last thing i do for tonight okay y'all so it is the next day the next day i think i don't know but it's thursday november 30th that's crazy that today is the last day of november but if it looks like i'm in a different car it's because i am so i was nice enough so we have a company car at my job and then but the worker who drives it because he his job is so important he can't leave to come get it service so i came and got it service for him so i've been sitting at the hyundai dealership for the past two freaking hours i'm just putting on sunscreen right now y'all but i've been sitting at the hyundai dealership for two freaking hours but it's not really i'm not hating because like I was trying to get some work done, but they kept playing like freaking Christmas music. And I was getting so irritated. Cause I mean, y'all can call me a Grinch or whatever, but I hate Christmas music, I'm sorry. Like I really do. So they kept playing Christmas music 
and then all the employees in there who's like the car salesman at least this time they didn't bother me but they all sit in there talking and being loud so i cannot get anything like when i'm trying to work i need like silence like absolute silence so anyway needless to say we're about to head out of the car dealership and it's a nice car i wish they would let me drive this car as a company car but you know that's neither here or there but i like how it lets my phone sit up because like i'm gonna show y'all hold on i'm waiting to these two people walk by but i like how i like how it lets my phone sit up because i don't need a tripod in this car like my phone could just sit up right there but we're gonna leave i'm starving we're about to go get some lunch and there's so many uh i was looking up places i wanted to eat at it's so many places to eat but let me show y'all the car so it's so high techy like i'm not used to none of this like look at this like when you put on your uh signal light it has like cameras to like you know see well yeah the cameras and then like the dashboard i don't know if y'all can see that but like right there it has your miles per hour but it just adjusts your seat when you get in this is a genesis gv80 i want to say and i did not know these cars were this nice but it's just like a sedan or whatever and it's the brake pad and you know everything like that and i really like this touch screen thing right here so yeah we just gonna go get something to eat that's a quick little car too i might include a picture of this in my thumbnail of the car because it's just so cute you know not as like no clickbait or nothing but i don't know it's just cute so yeah okay y'all so i got this pad tie and it's pretty decent it's not as good as some of the other ones that I've done had before, but it's it's straight. They ain't had no yum yum sauce or nothing like that. And I have one of some yum yum sauce. I'm a complete fatty for real, cause so the restaurant I ate was like a little bit over there, maybe like right there. And then I walked to Cold Stone Creamery, but they don't open until 12, but luckily it's 11.55. So am I gonna sit here and wait for them to wait? Wait for them to open? I absolutely am. Now I feel like I need something sweet, which I really don't need it, but I'm gonna get it. But I'm gonna get me like a little small cup. I'm not gonna OD, I'm not gonna do too much. Cause I really been doing good this week. I've been cooking at home every single night. And then since I'm out and I didn't bring my lunch since I had to go get the car service, I was planning on going to get lunch today anyway. And then I'm going to get me like a little small little cup of ice cream. It's going to be so good. And then we're going to head back to work, I guess. But I'm going to kill. Good time because like, it's 11.56. And it's probably going to take me like maybe 25 minutes to get back to work. So we're going to kill good time and whatever. And hopefully I can get some work done when I get back to work. Not day work, but like YouTube stuff. Because really like... <laughs> I do work at nine to five, but I really don't be like, I spend, I have my day section off. So I spend like only so much. Cause let's just be honest. Like it don't take eight hours to do a day's work. It really don't depend on what job you got. Like it only probably takes five or six hours. I don't know why we have an eight hour work day, which is ridiculous, but I only do like their work, like office work for like two, for two hours, like first thing in the morning. And then like the rest of the day, Unless somebody comes to my office and they need something for the rest of the day. I'm about to do my own thing because who? Who? So, <sighs> yeah, I'm just going to wait for them to open. And I'm going to show y'all what I got. I'm so slow. I literally Googled what time they open and the hours are right there on the door. It literally says Monday through Sunday, 12 to 9. this is what i got this is like first of all i'm glad i got this side i feel like she like messed with me on the low a little bit because she gave me a lot more but it, really, hold on. it really just pays to be nice to people because i feel like they've messed with you a lot more but this is um it's called cookie dough peanut butter cookie dough or something like that because i love like peanut butter and reese's pieces so it's got reese's pieces peanut butter cookie dough ice cream and then I add a brownie to it. No, it's so good. I'm already kind of like feeling the effects of my other food. Cause let's just stop lying. Like when you eat dirty, 
you feel that mentally you feel that brain fog so i'm low-key feeling that brain fog my other food especially since i've been eating so clean like all these other days but it's okay i'm gonna just take that L today i'll probably feel worse after this ice cream but <sighs> i'm gonna eat a good dinner it's gonna be clean and healthy so i'll probably do a salad or something for dinner and yeah, i'm gonna enjoy my ice cream head back and i'll catch up with y'all in the rickery I'm sorry, if y'all don't know what that means, when somebody said they'll catch up with you in the record, that means they're going to catch up with you in a few. I know some people may. <laughs> that's old Southern slang. Okay, y'all, we in Aldi. Aldi Avenue. Y'all, I'm going to say it. I'm looking for some fries. Okay, they're going to stay fried. Usually, I come with the point of So what I was trying to say in the grocery store before I was just so rudely interrupted. So I went into Aldi. Um, today, today's today's Friday, by the way. But it's Friday. It's like five fifty, almost six o'clock. I went into Aldi and I got some ketchup because we ran out of ketchup because it's this particular. And I got some steak fries, but it's this particular. I've been craving like y'all know what Zach sauce is. It depends on what area of the, of the country that you're in, but like Zach sauce, raisin cane sauce. Y'all know that chicken, that chicken tender sauce. So I saw this simple, simple recipe on pictures when I was at work the other day, and I didn't know it was that easy. So all you need is ketchup, mayo, salt, pepper, Worcestershire sauce, and paprika. Six ingredients. So I was like, I'm making that. So I got, I'm gonna make some chicken tenders, but I'm gonna just do them like how I did it on Monday. Just cook them on the stove top. I'm gonna get ready to like marinate them and stuff now with that stuff that we, that, you know, that marinade. But I'm gonna just cook them on the stove top. But I just really just want the sauce. Cause I love like that sauce. And I didn't, I never knew it was that easy to make. So what we need to do is that, but we also need to, we still need to work out because this morning I woke up on time. I really did. I just fell back asleep and I was almost late to work. So I feel like I can really just knock out this workout and then do another one tomorrow morning and I knock out my four days for the week. I think I'm gonna do it. I need something. I need like a little snackers on first to like put on my stomach. Like, but I think I'm gonna do it. Cause like, I just, I just woke up and went back to sleep. So, but I'm gonna actually do like a workout work, like my workout regimen I'm supposed to do. Cause I'm supposed to do like, my program is like for three days. And then Mondays, I just do the treadmill. If I do work out, I'm gonna do like the actual workout. And we still gotta fold them clothes that we didn't fold other. I don't know, it's just been a week. It has definitely been a week for me. Like I, I'm, I couldn't even come on camera some days. So I'm just fighting through right now, but I'm okay now. I'm okay now, but I'm just, you know, we had to fight through. So yeah, we about to get into that as I change this light. All right, so we're post-workout, fresh shower, skincare, all that done turn this off so i can concentrate on what i'm saying all that done so i got i'm gonna put my steak fries in the air fryer i'm gonna try not to od on the fries like my main course is chicken but i want it since i have like chicken fingers i wanted fries and they're air fried so that's not terrible but i'm gonna try not to od on the fries and then i still got the rest of this protein shake to drink but we're gonna make this sauce and i'm excited this stuff i got on my eyes like under my eyes it's so sticky like i hate sticky products like need some more products mayo ketchup worcestershire shot west west you know what i'm trying to say worcestershire shots pepper paprika and salt dang we almost out of the mayo i don't think i'm gonna need one cup though like that's that's a lot Okay, good. It's still good because I was scared that it wasn't pepper, paprika, and salt. I wonder if they want ground pepper. But yeah, like when you're trying to like lose weight and stuff, tone up your body, you're trying to eat right, just make the same things that make it a restaurant, but in a healthy way. Like we ain't got to fry this chicken. Really, I'm just a sauce person. I don't care if the chicken's fried, baked, grilled. Like as long as I got some sauce to dip it into, I'm going to be all right. I feel like they're low-key really from the bus. All right.
you step out Get some in now, let your edge out To some ice, but you'll be heavy in my mind Can you get the heck out? I mean, grass now, got me bummed out so Okay, so I'm just getting a fork to break all this up I'm finna taste it but I gotta make sure I get everything mixed up. Cause I'm gonna be disgusted if I taste this and it's, you know, it looks like everything mixed up. It's very. I think we might be on to something, y'all. It don't look. It don't look the exact same, like the little packages and containers, but I ain't gonna lie, this this is actually really good. Yeah, let me refrigerate this for a little while. Okay, y'all, so there's my chicken tenders, my fries, and my sauce. That's a good little stir. Dip my fry in it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, my chicken's still real hot, but this is what we got going on for a good Friday night in. So, yeah.